you want to change, you want to quit your job, you want to end a relationship, you want to do what you love, you want to travel the world, and you're waiting for permission, I'm here to tell you stop asking for permission and start living your life. Stop asking for permission, stop asking for approval from all the people around you and start trusting yourself. Why are we asking permission? You want to love a life of freedom? You want a life without permission, yet you're asking for permission? It's so contradictory. I'm here to tell you why we're actually seeking approval and how can you make decisions that will make you achieve the life of your dreams without asking for approval. That is what this video is all about. And I get it because I've been there. I was stuck in a corporate job and I didn't like it and I wanted to quit. I wanted to grow my own online business. I wanted to have freedom to do what I wanted. But at 40 years old, I was asking my parents, do you approve? Like, can I do this? And they said, no, no, stay in your job. Like you're earning well, you have a car, you have all these financial things. No, don't do it. But I did, and it's super scary. But I'm here to tell you, okay, first of all, why is all that approval needed? Where is this coming from? And what can you do if you're in that spot of making a decision? What can you do to live a life without regrets without asking that permission and that approval? If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel because I make videos every week and I give you my best value, my tips and suggestions to be able to achieve that, leave of, that life of your dreams, right? To be able to live a life of fulfillment. And that is what I do. And that's how I help my clients as well. And I'm just sharing everything that I learn and that I've learned and that I've practiced and that I really hope is helping you as well. So please subscribe, hit that like button, let YouTube know like, hey, you have to watch Rachel's video and be back next week and comment, always comment. I love reading your comments, but going back to permission. First of all, where is all of this coming from? Well, back in the Asian times, you know, when, when we were in a tribe and we had to rely on the tribe for our survival. We needed the approval of the tribe for our survival. So that's where all of this is coming from and our brain is wired on asking for approval. However, in these modern times, when you're walking down the street, there are no tigers chasing you, right? You don't need to ask for per permission or approval from a tribe or from anybody else, right? So that is the Asian time. Yet, we still do. And like I said, when I was 30, 40 years old, I was like, oh, I, I need the approval of my parents. Like if I have a major decision in my life, I want their approval. But as a child, we rely on our parents for our survival. So we need the approval of our parents for our growth and, and, and survival, right? So, but now we're an adult and we're still seeking that approval. It is not needed. Why are we really doing that? Like, and it's not just the parents, but maybe you're in a job and you're, you, you like your boss to, to give you approval, right? Like you, you go to these performance appraisals and it's like, oh, I check in the box. Like, yes, I did a good, I have a good appraisal, right? And, and you, you just, you, or you ask colleagues or are you waiting for a compliment? And there's all these ways of, of, of getting approval. Why? Why are you doing that? Because you don't trust yourself? For me, that was a thing. Like, I was asking other people's approval all the time. And yes, it's partly people-pleasing. And I'll put the video about people-pleasing and why that is and what you can do about people-pleasing right in the description below and up here. But it's partly people-pleasing, doing what other people are expecting from you, right? And pleasing other people because that makes you feel good, the, the need to please others. But on the other hand, it's the asking for approval because we trust others more than ourselves. So I'm asking you, are you not trusting yourself? What can you do to give yourself permission? What can you do to trust yourself? Remember, life is a C between B and D. Life is a C between B and D. B is birth, D is death, 
and C is the choices that you make. Choices and decisions that you make. So life is a choice between B and D, right? You have the choices to make. It's your life. You have decisions to make. So I want you to think about a decision that you've made in your life. And maybe you haven't done so already, but a decision that you have made and you did not get approval from your parents, from your loved ones. Have you had that before? It's super scary. It's super scary the first time that you do it. Maybe you wanted to buy that car and nobody wanted you to buy the car, but you did it anyway. Maybe you wanted to quit your job like I did and nobody wanted that, but I did it anyway. Maybe you wanted to start a business and it's like all these major decisions. It's super scary, but the thought that you need permission, the thought that you need approval, it's a lie. It's a lie. You don't need, you're an adult. You don't need approval. Look, if you want to live a life without regrets, if you want to live and do what you love, if you have a dream and a goal like I had a few years ago, don't ask, stop waiting for that permission. Start taking the steps towards it. Look, you will have good days and you will have bad days. But you will have nothing if you don't take action. And if, you, if your actions are based on, on others' approval, nobody's living your life. Like whose life are you living? Yours or somebody else's? Are you always going to follow the footsteps of somebody else or are you going to start living your life? How old are you? If you're unhappy in your life right now, where will you be five years from now? You will be still unhappy and you'll be five years older and you still need to take that first step because you haven't made a decision because you're waiting for approval. You, you, you're born alone. You will die alone. You need to make decisions in your life and stop waiting for permission. Other people are not living your life and you're not following. You're not living anybody else's life. This is your life. So now you know, where is this all permission and approval coming from? You don't need it. The thought you need it in the permission or an approval, it's a lie. You can do it if you start believing in yourself and start trusting yourself. I want you to give yourself permission to make a decision for your life and to take steps towards that. All right. So make that step. Comment below, what is the next step that you will take towards the life that you love? It's your life, nobody else's. If you still feel stuck, there's a free video training right below. I'll put it in the description and in the comment to get unstuck. You can follow that. You can talk to me. I'm here for you. Clarity leads to confidence, leads to courage. Get clear on your goal. Start taking action. And just that small step, always small steps, always small actionable steps that will move you closer to your dream goal. Don't wait for anybody else to do it for you. It's your life. You only have one life. Live it without regrets. Thanks so much. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and I'll see you next week.